My dear friends, I am Bishop Gerald John Mathias, Bishop of Lucknow. I am happy to introduce to you a book that I got published recently by the Asian Trading Corporation ATC in Bangalore. It was released by His Eminence Cardinal Luis Antonio Tagle, Prefect of the Dicastery for Evangelization in Rome during a recent CCBI meeting held in Bangalore in January. The book is titled Gleanings. Gleanings, Morality, Synodality, Spirituality and Magisterium. It contains 40 articles that I wrote over four decades. All of them are put together in this one volume. It deals with various topics, some on moral issues like human life is sacred, conscience and morality, war on life today, euthanasia, duty to preserve life, homosexuality, pornography and such moral issues, critical issues. It also contains in another part various encyclicals and magistral documents, a brief commentary on these various documents like Dives in Misericordia, Veritate Splendor, Centesimus Annus, Caritas in Veritate, Amoris Laetitia, Laudato Si, Fratelli Tutti, Gaudete Resultate, Samaritanus Bonus, etc. In third part, also have three articles on synodality, a very recent topic. And the fourth part deals with some topics on spirituality. So there are 40 articles published basically in various periodicals, various journals in India like Vidya Jyoti, Jivadhara, Living Word and the New Leader, Indian Currents, Examiner, etc. They are put together in one volume. Cardinal Philip Neri Ferrao has written a beautiful foreword for this. I would like to end with his few lines that he wrote in the foreword. He says, And church teachings today, particularly those regarding life issues like transmission of life, preservation of life, abortion, euthanasia, homosexuality, are often met with rejection. Bishop Matthias presents the church teaching on such issues in a very scholarly and convincing manner. I thank my beloved brother in the Episcopate for sharing with us his deep faith knowledge and wisdom to help us live a fruitful life of Christian discipleship. May gleanings find the warm reception it so richly deserves. The book will be very useful, my dear friends, for seminarians, for priests, for novices, for all the formies, for the sisters, for lay faithful, doctors, nurses, etc. I recommend this book to be available in, from an order from ATC Publications, Bangalore. Thank you and God bless you.